hello guys welcome back to good show tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix resident evil 4 is having audio or sound is not working or it is crackling or it is muffled and popping or audio is not working issue and how we can fix this out so let's dive into this so the first one is all about we just need to restart the game that is what you need to do for restarting the game we just need to quit everything just we need to do the restart after restart is successfully done you just have to uh, play it once again when you have to start it from once again and you have to check whether the issue is for uh, solved or not next one is all about we need to check the volume mixer for that over here as you can see if you go at the sound over here now this being set into 100 percentage now you just have to click on this icon now from here you just have to go over here in the sound now from here you just have to make sure that the volume is being set into 100 and the volume is being set into 100 for these two as well as over here this should be set into 100 or else we'll be having the trouble so we just have to check it has been set into 100 next one is all about we need to select the right audio device in sound setting for that we just need to go over here in the search now go to settings now from here just go to sound from here, we just need to click on the speakers and make sure this is Realtek R Audio, which is my speaker. And make sure this is 100% reach. Over here, as you can see, the microphone is also Realtek R Audio. And I have set this to 100% reach as well. This is what I have to do. So make sure both the thing is being set into 100% reach and you have selected only the right speaker. So over here, as you can see, it is Realtek R Audio. As well as here, it is also Realtek R Audio, which means I have selected the correct speaker. And this is what you have to do. Next one is all about we need to select the sound sample rate to 148 or 44 kilohertz in the sound panel. For that, we just need to go over here in the search. Now, from here, we need to go to control panel. Now, go to sound. From here, we have to select the speaker, right click, and go to properties. Now, go to uh, sorry. We just need to go over here, advance it, and make sure this is being set into correct. Over here, this is 24 bit. So we have four options that is 64 bit, 4400 hertz, 16 bit, 4800 hertz. Then we have uh, 24 bit, 4400 hertz. Then we have 24 bit, 48000 hertz. Right? We need to select the respective one from here, correct one, then go for OK. Once after that, we just need to try to play the game and we need to see whether that's going to fix the issue or not if that is not working we have to move to the next one that is we need to con uh, disconnect every controller if it's already connected some of you might be playing the game with controllers connected to it for example you know uh, the joystick controller some might be playing the game in multiple uh, connecting to multiple monitors and all those things if that is the case we just need to disconnect everything especially the controllers after everything is disconnected successfully just launch the game then afterwards connect the controller back and see whether that is going to fix the issue or not that is what we have to do next one is all about we need to turn off spatial sound for that we need just need to go over here in the search now we need to go to control panel once again go to sound over here from here go to properties right click and go to properties once again go to spatial sound and if this being turned on we have to turn this off once after that we just need to go for apply and close everything then we just need to try to play the game once again that is going to work for you as well next one is all about we need to disable the oculus voice, uh, voice meter if it's already connected for that we need to go over here in the search go to control panel once again go to sound over here you can see that we are having speakers and no oculus is connected if oculus is connected you will be able to see this so if you find the oculus connected then you just have to right click on the oculus and go for disable it and once you have successfully disabled the oculus we just need to close this and we need to try to uh, you need to play the game once again and you can see the differences next one is all about we need to disable external and internal microphone uh, that uh, we just need to do as it is that is quite important next one we need to do is we just need to uh, install the audio drivers that is quite important step that is just do like this so for that just go over here click on the device manager go to device manager over here now go to audio you just need to check the sound video over here now just select the realtek r audio just update the driver 
make sure this is up to date or if you get in the slot you can just finish it out as well i mean you just need to uh, make sure this is up to date as well as install you can do this from your side last and the least one is all about we need to update the windows for that we need to go over here in the search now go to settings now from here go to windows update at the bottom keep scrolling down download and install uh, if you're getting any update uh, like this download and install it and if you have any kb update just fix everything and install the windows as well these are the possible workarounds that you have to try out when you're having an issue with resident evil audio or sound is not working and uh, uh, how you can fix this up and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification see you soon in the next video peace out bye bye